Today, I'm making crispy salt and pepper shrimp. This is gonna be good. To start, I'm going to prep some ingredients. Here I have the white of green onion. I just had this left over from another recipe. You could also just use some yellow onion or scallion. Here I'm going to slice one large jalapeno, seeds and all. Now, if you want extra spice, use some serrano peppers and you could use more jalapeno if you like. Now in a bowl, I'm going to add around a half cup, a third to a half cup of cornstarch. I'm also going to add a half teaspoon of onion powder, a half teaspoon of garlic powder, and give that a mix. Now I'm going to prep one pound of shrimp. Here I've already rinsed it in cold water. I removed the head, the veins. So now I'm going to add a quarter cup of Shaoxing cooking wine. I will put a link for this type of wine. It really does help the flavor. I'm gonna add this to a larger bowl to make things easier. Now I'm going to sprinkle in my cornstarch dredge. And with clean hands, I'm just going to toss the shrimp and coat it well with the cornstarch. This is what's going to make the exterior crispy. Now it's time to cook and fry the shrimp. Here I've preheated my cooking oil to around 360 degrees Fahrenheit, and I'm just going to cook this in batches in a shallow fry. It's going to take maybe a minute on each side. This is large to extra large shrimp with the shell on, so it's not going to take a long time to cook. You all know that shrimp just cooks so quickly and you don't want to overcook it. So I'm going to give it a flip. And as you can see, it's already turning pink. It's starting to curl. So I'm just going to remove this batch from the fry oil. You can set it on paper towels. I like to put it on a rack over a baking sheet or here I have a wire metal strainer over a bowl. Now I'm just going to repeat the process until all of my shrimp is cooked like this. I'm going to take some of that fry oil and add it to another pan. This is sort of like a wok slash pan. I'm going to crank up the heat to a medium high to high heat and I'm going to saute the whites of my green onion. Go ahead and saute that for a minute. It's going to go quick at this point. Now I'm going to add in my sliced jalapeno. And like I stated earlier, if you really want this spicy, go for some serrano peppers. That will be spicy. So now I'm going to add in my cooked shrimp. And I'm really not cooking the shrimp at this point. I'm just coating it with a little bit of that flavorful oil. I shut off the heat. And you're just going to coat and toss the shrimp with the jalapeno and onion. Now I'm going to add a quarter teaspoon of salt and a quarter teaspoon of cracked black pepper. And this is it. This is lunch for my husband and my son. They're gonna have this with steamed rice and it's so good. I'm gonna plate it up and I'm gonna show you how crispy the exterior is. So I'm just giving you guys a warning for those that don't like eating sounds, tune away right now. Listen to that crispy crunch. Now I know some people that eat the shell. You could peel this, eat however you like. So I hope you give this recipe a try. I hope you like it. And thanks for watching.